This video will show you how to create a playlist in Naxos and embed it into a Canvas course to make it available to your students. We'll start at naxosmusiclibrary.com and log in. You might already have your own personal username and password for Naxos, but since we want to create a playlist that we can share and embed, we need to log in using OU's administrator username and password. The username is UOklahomaPS. Please note the capital letters at the beginning and end. The password is exactly the same. Now we'll create a playlist. Let's search for Tuba Concerto. We'll click on an album and choose the tracks we want. Then we click Add to Playlist on the left side of the page. We'll give our playlist a name, Tuba Concertos, and click Add to Playlist. We can add more tracks to the playlist. Let's click the back button to continue looking at other albums. Just like before, we'll select the tracks we want and click Add to Playlist. This time we don't need to create a playlist, we need to select the same one, Tuba Concertos. Now that we've created our playlist, we need to get something called a static URL, so we can embed the playlist into Canvas. You can think of the static URL as a permanent link that will always take us to our playlist. To find the static URL, we'll click on Playlists near the top of the page. This shows us a list of playlists. There's ours, Tuba Concertos. Near the top right corner, let's click on Display Static URL to Playlist. Now we can see the static URL and copy it. And now we can move over to Canvas. We'll navigate to the course page where we want to embed the playlist. We could simply paste the static URL into the page, but that doesn't look very nice. It's long and untidy. Instead, let's some say something descriptive like Tuba Concerto Playlist. We can then select this text and click on the link icon and paste the static URL here. Now we can see that the text has become a clickable link. Let's save this page and then click on the playlist to make sure it's working. Perfect! The playlist opens up and we can click on the play button to listen to it. There's another way to embed a playlist into a course so that the playlist opens up within the same page. To do this we need something called an iframe code. This is a piece of HTML code that you can see at the bottom of this video or in the video description. It looks like this. We'll copy this code and then go over to the Canvas page where we want to embed the playlist. We'll go to Edit and then choose HTML Editor and paste the iframe code into the page. Next, we'll go back to Naxos and copy the playlist's static URL and then go back to our Canvas page. We'll select the part of the code that says Insert Link Here. We'll delete this and paste the static URL in its place. Next, and this is very important, you need to add the letter S after HTTP. This is a security feature that is required by Canvas. 
Now we save the page. The playlist appears right in the same window and we can click the play button to listen to it.